Rosalind Nashashibi and uh, I'm an artist, mainly working in 16mm film. And here at Glasgow International I'm showing a film called Lovely Young People, Beautiful Supple Bodies that I made in collaboration with Scottish Ballet and Glasgow International. I attended rehearsals for four or five visits over a couple of years. It was about me finding my sort of way of, inter of bringing something to that rather than just observation of rehearsals. And eventually I thought that it was more to do with how we, the non-dancing rest of the world, look at them rather than actually just observing the dancers from the camera. It was more through other eyes, through mirrors, thinking about the ideas and desires and expectations that we project onto the dancers. So I decided to bring people living or working around Tramway in the south of Glasgow where the Scottish Ballet is based to come in just from the street with their coats, with their bags and just walk into the rehearsal and just react to them. So we see a lot through their eyes and, and through mirrors. So the sort of the dancers also looking at themselves, seeing themselves through the mirror. So it's also, there's a lot in the film about perception, about the doubling of perception back and forth and about what looking actually looks like. Everybody's looking and being looked at. The title, Lovely Young People, Beautiful Supple Bodies, is, um, what came from the comments of a group of women who, who came to see the, came into the rehearsals. And it was followed by a sort of sigh of longing. In a way, there's something also about age in the film. There's a lot of the people who came in quite a lot older than the dancers. So they were not only projecting about the elegance, their idea of the life of the dancer, their idea of the, the mythology of the dancer, but also the youth, the youthfulness, the purity, in general, my films work a lot in the border between observation from reality and constructed fictional or mythological aspects, scenes that I've put in. And I'm, I'm very interested in the, the border between the two, where, where reality and fiction actually meet. All of the, the international aspects were already there, in a way, in Glasgow, because the artists here are working internationally, those from Scotland and those who've come to Glasgow from all over the world. I mean, that's, that was the case already when I left. But it's just nice to see so many, so much audience coming from, from everywhere. I like the fact that it's compact into two weeks, so it doesn't become this kind of tired thing after everyone's left and the works are still kind of stumbling on. It's, it really feels like an exciting moment of coming together of lots of projects and lots of people and it's nice for me to come back at this stage after so many years and be part of it.